A company in Benin is transforming everyday bio waste into a powerful energy source, all thanks to an entrepreneur who believes nothing should go to waste, be it at home or in the farms. Homes in Benin have been transformed ever since an entrepreneur decided to make it his priority to improve lives and change the living conditions of Beninins. How does he do that? By making their kitchens environmentally conducive. Like this woman, whose entire produce, from the fish scales to the waste that she collects throughout the day, is put to good use, powering her stove. Enoch Naga is the brains behind this innovation. But what motivated him to venture into bio-waste management? Nous avons as a student, we noticed that when we left class with the power outages, it was really difficult. I got into the mindset of one day being able to think about solving the problem of electrical energy. One evening, I was preparing food and inadvertently, the candle I was using in the kitchen fell into my food waste bin and it caught fire. When it caught fire, I thought, what is this? I became interested in this by discussing with my environmental chemistry professor. That's where he told me that it was okay. It's biogas. Naga, now 36, spearheads Benin Biogas, a local firm transforming everyday bio waste into a powerful energy source. His small but dedicated team is revolutionizing the way hundreds of homes and over a dozen farms in Benin manage waste and energy. Under Naga's leadership, Biogas Benin has built networks of concrete tanks ranging from 10 to 124 cubic meters beneath neighborhoods and industrial zones. The tanks are reactors transforming organic waste into biogas, a methane-rich energy source that provides cooking and heating fuel for over 560 households. And it's not just stoves. In some areas, compost waste production is so large that Biogas Benin provides 24-hour off-grid electricity to surrounding neighborhoods. We need to think with simple solutions to create in our environment. Solutions so that the population really acclimatizes, adopts the technology. You can see what we already do locally. Everywhere we have masons at home and that's where we train. We took teams, we started working with them. And in the end, we saw that by building in the ground, this allows us to work very simply without machines, without anything besides the waste that we already produce in our homes, on our farms. Beyond providing energy, Benin Biogas's plan is also to convert compost waste into high-quality fertilizer, supporting local agriculture and reducing local farmers' reliance on imported, expensive, and potentially damaging alternatives. Fossil energy will still be used, but the percentage will decrease progressively. And by installing these decentralized power plants in communities, we will realize that at some point, we will have an improved quality of life, a totally sanitized place, and the problem related to the availability of fertilizers today will also be resolved. So biogas will not only help Benin to be energy independent, to move to decentralized production, but will also strengthen Benin in the agricultural sector, which employs a good part of the workforce, the valid hand. In a world grappling with climate change and the search for sustainable energy solutions, Naga hopes Benin Biogas's complete waste to energy cycle will usher in a renewed dedication to environmental stewardship for his country. Bureau Report, We On, World is One. We On is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.